this start of this conversation was Jay Z is a businessman. Because right? yeah. if we talk in culture, you still have to add how New Orleans is one of the blackest cities in the United States no of America. Li- no lies. It's, no lies. No lies. It's the same way from Kendrick no being lies. the blackest city. What do you, what Kendrick do you mean? is I, one of the most pro black artists. If anything, Lil Wayne has said, I don't give a fuck that. about what these black niggas is doing. Whoa, whoa. I'm doing me. Hold on, hold on, hold on. If we're talking black culture. Hey, let's not bring that up. Hold on, hold on. If we're talking black culture. Let's not bring that up. Let's not bring that up. I'm going to blow it up. Let's not bring that up. Nah, let's not bring that up. Why did Roger get. I didn't want to go. I'm about to blow it up. They got me mad. All right. Nah, they got me mad. I'm about to blow it up. Wait, hold on. Let me get some more. Let me get some more. I'm about to blow it up. I'm about to blow it up. I'm trying to keep it cool. I know we're about to fight. I know we're about to fight. I know we're about to fight. Why did Roger Goodell Uh-oh. and the NFL seek after Jay Z? Was it because the NFL always had a culture? Was it because what was it? Let's be honest here. It's because they weren't looking that good to black people, correct? Correct. It's because black culture needed to meet big business. Black culture needed to meet business. Is that something they ever cared about until Colin Kaepernick took no. a knee? The climate and the okay. market of certain things changed things. Okay. And that's one of the things that was determined based on those circumstances. But what you do is you go get the biggest person yes. who can embody all of that. And the bi- one of our leaders in the, the, the entertainment community, black community, is Jay-Z. Who better than to bring in to have on this committee? He's always, this is why he's him. And outside, like, we hear all these rappers talk about Jay-Z in the period, right? We hear all the time, DMX sold more than Hove. Ja Rule at some point sold more than Hove. And then we hear all of these people, but the reason Hove is Hove is not just because of his music or his talent. It's because he's always able to have the, the vision. This is a part of that vision. Yeah. Little Wayne is culture, embodies New Orleans culture. Yes. yes. Taylor Swift embodies business. Big business. So you know what I'm going to do? And, and her culture. And her culture. What I'm going to do is I'm going to make that meet in the middle better than any other place that I can. And that is Kendrick Lamar. Because, so, because, all right, because granted, right? Granted, if you're an NFL fan, you're probably looking at the Chiefs like, okay, yeah, they're probably going to have a shot of going back to the Super Bowl. Right, mm-hmm. right. Even if they don't go to the Super Bowl, I yes. can assure you, yes, Taylor is probably going to be in one and, of them sky boxes. And it's, mm-hmm. and, and what's going to happen? NFL cameras, whether it's on Fox, ABC, NBC, Peacock, whatever the fuck it is, mm-hmm. them cameras are going to be right there on what? On Taylor, yeah. Watching Taylor, watch Kendrick, and but, then and then they're going to give a pie chart. Oh, viewers <laughs> oh, that okay. viewers that loved and they watched Kendra, they watched uh, Taylor Swift. She was on the camera for about fifty mm-hmm. seconds, and they were like, remember. "Yep, they did it last year." Right, I remember. Taylor is good for their business. Hold on, and she has been proven good for their business. Uh-huh. Hold on, I'm bugging. Yeah, I no, see Yvonne. I'm bugging. I, I'm, 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 I'm bugging. Well, yeah, wait, what's wrong? It's with that? funny. It's oh, funny. Right. It's funny because we only speak into black culture, which I love and respect. But I was thinking to the NFL business. That, that, that's and, what and, I'm but, speaking but to right the now. The NFL has a business side and a culture side. So to your point about Taylor Swift, one of the biggest pop stars in the world that's dating one of the top players in the NFL yeah. would fit their culture. So my thing here is, okay, I Not understand. Jay-Z. Rock Nation, I, the halftime look, look, is Rock Nation. At the Nation. end of the day, Jay-Z has to, you guys told me this already, right? It's not just Jay-Z. He also has to satisfy the people above him, Correct? 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 Like the committee. It coincides. It coincides. It coincides. Because they're 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 let's be honest. There's a head of music in the NFL. Then you got the city of New Orleans who has that how we brought up that that yes. You know, those people. Absolutely. Jay is not the from what I'm understanding, what I try to really get a good information about today was like, is he the end all be all? And clearly he's not. Does the NFL care if Jay Z just satisfies the black people? If Jay Z what? I'm sorry. If Jay Z only satisfies the black people. Does the NFL care? The last yes. four the last four years who 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 have been the highlight That's about force. That's about force though. I'm saying it just in general. Do you I, think the NFL really gives a fuck? I really do. Okay. So then why I'm not if, if they if they didn't, why the fuck would he be in, in that position in any capacity? Why was it only a five year deal? Because you know what a five year deal tells me from I wasn't in the media. I wasn't in the fucking media. Can I speak? Can I speak? Can I speak? You want right, a soul? No, can no, I speak? No, okay, you got it. When I see five year deal, I go, damn. Look like y'all, y'all trying to cover y'all steps for right now. You know what? The NFL is really, really shitty. There are some black people, there are some African Americans out there that are looking at this league as disgusting. Yeah. They don't like what we align with. They don't like the owners and shit. Right. So you know what? 
Let's do damage control for the next few years. And not like a lifelong change. Thank you. For yeah. the, that's, and that's what I'm saying. So it's like, at the end of the day, he still has to satisfy everybody, Jay-Z. Business is business. Yes. When you sign a business deal, unless you're like a fucking billionaire, contrillionaire, a lot of those business deals aren't for 20, 30 fucking years. They're for five, seven, six, eight, I, two. maybe at two. Look at LeBron James every year. I'm one, one year. year, one year, year. What, did, yo, what, did, what did Steph Curry just get? A <laughs> one, one year, year extension. <laughs> for, for that's that's like wait, 64, like a, 65 that's million in a wait, year. Wait, but wasn't that's that like different. an age clause kind of thing? Who for uh for uh, Bron? For no, for Steph Curry, wasn't that like the year? I mean, well, yeah, no. What I'm what I'm saying to you is a lot of those deals do not extend past maybe three, four, five okay. years. Jay Z is never gonna sign a twenty million, a twenty year deal. Would he sign twenty he's million? Gonna, would he sign a twenty year this. deal to do that? Is, is Jay-Z, not, y'all think Jay Z gonna re up with NFL? You think y'all think that's gonna happen I, again? Yes, I think. Y'all, la- y'all, y'all really think that? I if think we if we see <laughs> what happens, this if we see what happens February 9th. <laughs> fuck what happened February 9th. Oh, we shit, know what that's gonna do. Last year he had the second highest view. Super Bowl ever. You know that he's always nominated for a fucking Emmy for that? Hey, salute to everybody on that production. All right. All yeah. of the productions are usually good when it comes <laughs> to the for, for, the, for, the last, for the last four years, he's been nominated but for... I you, salute you gotta, that black man. Like, okay. I salute him. B- before okay. Jay-Z started doing this, and we could kind of move on or, or maybe just shift the conversation, but even before Jay-Z and Rock Nation had this responsibility of bringing these artists to the halftime mm-hmm, show, like yeah. we remember like the Bruno Mars, right? But we also got to think about, I don't even know if they did it, but the fucking Coldplay's of the world. Like, well, there's Coldplay, a lot of... Because Coldplay was... Coldplay was a part of the Bruno Mars. No, no, Coldplay and that was, was De- the main was the main yes, artist, yes. And, and then that, they brought up Bruno Mars. And that Beyonce. was what? That was in Denver or San Francisco? It was that Super Bowl. I think it was the Denver Super Bowl. I Denver, think, yeah, I, Denver, and yeah. I don't know for sure. But what I'm saying is, there's a lot of misses. There's been a lot of misses or a lot of polarizing people who's done the halftime performance right. mm-hmm. since Hove has been there. We can list everybody who's done from J Lo to okay. her shit, right? J Lo, Shakira. Shakira. Okay. We had Rihanna. We, had, we, we got, had the weekend. We had the weekend. Uh-huh. Um, the Dr. Dr. Dre one. Usher, Usher. Right? Like, there is a cultural currency that Jay-Z is bringing to this that specific event. That little isn't a part of. I feel you. He may, and, and there's nothing wrong with saying that. <laughs> so you made it We laugh. don't know. See, here. That's, 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 no, no, here. that's, that's, that's why stop, I don't want to die on that culture here with y'all. Because this is New Orleans and Little Wayne. It's culture y'all. and it's I also know, business. I know we had some more auto tune verses for the last few years that maybe people didn't like no one, as much. No one's, so, no, so, no, one's, no, no one's saying anything about okay. his auto tune right. verses. Okay. Culturally, right? Okay. I'm not going to listen to Jay. Like, on the podcast, we listen to Jay Lowe's album on the podcast. Cause we had no choice. <laughs> it was it was fire too. The song we put on. We Yo, listened to J Lo's album. We did. We did that. All right. But in my personal life, I like Lo. I like Lo. <laughs> no, I get the little nuances. Yeah, we did it. Right? Yeah, 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 yeah. No, I get it. I get it. Go ahead. But go ahead. we're not going outside to listen to J Lo's album, which is we're not. not. Right, so so, yeah. but there's there's a way I'm to gonna connect watch, the I'm dots. I'm gonna watch Living Color. Okay, like, yeah. there's certain ways to connect the dots, and I think Jay Z or the, whatever committee is in charge of doing that is doing it at a very high level. I'm, again, we started this conversation by saying it's not that Little Wayne is not deserving, exactly, but we have to make sure we are hitting the mark every single and, that, and unfortunately, time. sometimes you have to put bu- your business decision and choices over. A cultural preference, and, and hopefully, that, and, and, that, and, and, and that, that's that just the world, bro. That's just the world. He I, should I understand. feel the world. Salute to the world, man. I just I know, feel I get, like I get you. You, you know, I, 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 I get you. I get you. I get you. He's he. No, I get, I get him. No, I, I get him. Oh, I love Nikki. I know you. You team Nikki. I'm not ready to cry out. I don't pick a side. Don't put that on me. You know I don't pick sides. I said on this episode already, but I love Nikki. What I'm saying is right, and this is really my point. She got me blocked. She got you blocked? Yeah, we can figure that out. I'm a ball. Yeah, no, and me. Yeah, she got me blocked. Yeah. Oh, you too? She nah, blocked you? I said Meek. Meek. Oh, and Meek. Meek oh, Meek, 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 Meek got you. 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 Meek Sort of. Jay was 95. when I was born. And Jay was 95. Well, no, Wayne was making music in 97 and 98. You. I, 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 Thank you. It intersected. Right. It. Thank you. Okay. Wayne was on the high. You and LV, squat up. Thank you. Thank you. It crossed. I got you. Okay, I got you. Thank you. They were both putting out projects 02, 03, 04. And Mr. Carter. Right. So what I'm saying is, I love Kendrick Lamar. I love this performance. I love what he did during the rap battle. Y'all can hear it on the past episodes, the previous episodes here. Saluted, I get it from a business standpoint. I wasn't even mad at it. I'm going to be honest with you. I get it. After the year he's coming off, amazing. However, 
if I'm <coughs> Jay Z, and I feel like this is only for him. The relationship that you've already had with Wayne, yeah. with the records, with the diss tracks, with the back and forth over the years, right. that is a part of the cachet that you've built with someone, right? right? So granted, though New Orleans has seen the Super Bowl 11 times, mm -hmm. I, like Savon said, it's not a homecoming show. No. I'm with Savon. Right, right. I, I remember, even the, um, the Usher joint, I thought it was in Atlanta, it wasn't, it was in Vegas. Vegas. Yeah. So I don't look at it as a homecoming show. What I will say though is- Also no, it looks, also, also uh -huh. no, Vegas had- uh -huh. Vegas had Usher for about two years. For the residency yes, over there, yeah. right? So, so that made that made a lot of sense. sense. So yeah, some yeah. people might feel like, yo, it's still like a homecoming of sorts. That made that made cool. Sense. I get Usher it. dances gotcha. and remembers his lyrics. Oh, Little Wayne, oh, let yeah. finish, let not, Little Wayne did thirty songs nice. at Rolling Loud, bro. That's you can go nice. look that up, bro. And that is not an easy task to do, nigga. Rolling I can't even. Rolling Loud is not Super Bowl. It's not the Super Bowl, but not at the end of the close. day, though, you still have to recite these words. Rolling Loud right? is a club of. I, I, I get with, that. You see what I'm saying? I, I get that. We love Rihanna. Rihanna wasn't dancing. She was pregnant. We let it rock. It was still entertaining. Like, come on, y'all. Yeah, but well, we're talking about. But no one can put on a show. That's what I'm saying. If Rihanna can put on a show, we're not saying we're not saying that Wayne cannot put on a show. We're not saying Wayne is not deserving. We're not saying Wayne does not have a catalog. We're not saying anything of that and the last thing that i'm gonna say off of this all we're saying is i've seen outside perspectives of like wayne isn't that because the reliability he's not you know professional i he's get not it. that that's all i can and, look and at and, excerpts, and, and, if, and, if, and if someone like jay is looking at that right right and you have 15 minutes but you just saw me you just you just saw me at fanatics fest man you you the internet has what seen have just to... let me finish bro just let me finish bro i know you don't give a fuck the human this shit don't this, mean nothing yeah, to you i get this, you this, this i feel you this is how me and cas be arguing me and cas is how me e bro when you say how this how you feel i don't change your thinking this is how i feel right and how i feel on a human level my nigga Bro, you just see me at the Fanatics Fest. Okay. There are excerpts everywhere on the internet from me doing podcasts and interviews about how I want to do the Super Bowl. Two years ago. Yes, two years ago. So gotcha. to your point, yeah. um, Lo, I feel you. There has been moments where he slipped up with the lyrics, right? Of course, of course. But the Super Bowl, like how y'all said, is one of those moments where you put the lean to the side. Where you put the butt to the side for an hour. These, I'm serious. This is and one of these. And you prepare yeah. Yeah. properly. Can We're you guarantee? Act, that, yes, that, that, I think I can guarantee that for that sort you of can performance. That he can, that he do that. He's a, yes, he's a grown ass man. Are okay. we really trying to say that Wayne no, no, doesn't no, no, have enough? No, no, no not you. Oh. Maybe this one. Do we? Can we really trying to say right now that Wayne doesn't have enough control to put the walk down for two weeks? I don't like, know. He will rise. Lil Wayne, Lil Lil Wayne the would walk. rise to the. Alex, yeah. Lil Wayne would rise to the occasion if he was given the chance. Yes, that's give what he's him saying. Three and minutes. you have that rapport with him for no, all these him, years. Pause. I know you're trying to watch nigga. Crazy. But wait, what is Pause, 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 pause. Whoa, you heard that, that nigga. was. You said give him three minutes. Pause, pause, pause. Yeah, pause. Hold that, hold that down. Hold that down. I know. I say my What if Kendrick? What if Kendrick brings out Lil Wayne and we did all this hoopla for nothing? He can't do it. Why? He got we, no, 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 I know the optics oh, okay. are crazy, but what if, I don't know. That'd be dope. What if, Do we what even if? know if Wayne fuck with Drake for real? I think so. I hope so. I hope so. Like, let me ask that? you this. What code is that? So let me ask you this. I hope so. I'm just asking the real. No, you're right. I know. You're right. Because, you're right. because you're right. You're right. You're right. I say right. that because right. we see how vocal Nicki Minaj has been over this last week when she it came lost, to Wayne. She lost her Wife out of there. She right? lost her she, yeah, she ain't say nothing today. They took yeah, her. Yeah, no. Uh, I ain't All right, my fault. They took all that. I don't want no smoke. I don't want no smoke. We've seen how she came to defense for Wayne. But. But mm. we've, been, we've been covering this Drake and Kendrick beef this, mm -hmm. this entire oh my, year, yeah, right? My, mm -hmm. my, 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 my. We ain't hear nobody say anything in defense of Drake. Nikki ain't say shit for Drake. Hey, Nikki hey, ain't say nothing. Because, 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 because Nikki feels more personal with this matter. Wayne didn't say anything. I would. No, I agree with that. Thank you. I, Nikki I, feel, I, I, I agree she with feels that. like Rock Nation has been blackballing her. So much so that, remember she did the VMAs? She was hosting the VMAs last year? Mm -hmm. Now Meg Thee Stallion is hosting the uh, VMAs. <gasps> Yo, all right. Yo. Come on, man. Yo, I'm, I'm not. I'm not yo, a liar. Yo, stop, stop pointing at me. No, because you've been doing that shit. Oh, fuck. No, because when I see it, when you see the thoughts, whenever it comes to Apple Music or Rock Nation, he's yeah. like, "Low, what you yeah. got?" I see the thoughts. I'm like, "Yo, so far." So Nikki, so Nikki, so I should run. So Nikki's taking this personally because she feels like Rock Nation and the face of Rock Nation has been trying to make another young lady the face of female rap. Through manipulation, not through music. So talking about manipulation, if that is her reason, she's standing on a, a, a cause for her own self. True. She, it's not for it's not True. for the cause of Fuck Wayne it. or Drake. Drake can take whatever he can get. But that's my thing. It's <laughs> not even a Drake thing. This is a Wayne thing. It, oh, yeah, it really okay. is. It really isn't. It really, it's, because it's like, a Jason. Like, yeah, bro. but like to his point, yeah. if it was a Drake thing. She really would have spoke up in this last three or four months. Nobody has said anything. Not a soul. 
Literally, we've yeah. been waiting. Not a soul. Not, not a soul. Birdman. Not a soul. Birdman, said it. Birdman hey. ain't say shit. And, and I'm not going to front. <laughs> I'm like, I'm like no, fact, Birdman got a Twitter? Yo, I'm not going to front. Low, <laughs> Savon. Like, that better pipe down. I'm nigga say, hey, yo, yo low. shaking my head. Low. Like, Birdman, what the fuck? Birdman done put it on Miss Gladys. Miss Gladys. <laughs> y'all, better, y'all better act right in here when y'all talk about Lil Wayne. He done put it on Miss Gladys. I ain't going to tell you niggas again. All right. You don't. You know what's about to happen if he don't put it on. R.P. Miss Gladys, nigga. 